Hello, hello, hello. Hello, Essentials families. It's the end of the year, and uh, my, this is probably the most packed week I've ever had in the year because I'm doing end of year stuff, and I'm also tutor prepping, etc. So this is why I'm doing a video instead of typing, because I prefer to speak rather than type. Okay, uh, t uh, Monday, we're going to do week 24. We're going to do the lesson plans. We're also going to do the store. Uh, so the kids are going to be able to redeem uh, some byproduct, one or more items, maybe more, maybe one, with their um, with their tickets that they've earned all year. So that'll be fun. My goal is to make sure that I have stuff that is age appropriate for our kids, stuff that they're going to want, so that everybody's happy. I want all the girls to get something that they would like. It'll be a fun, it'll be a toy or some kind of craft or something like that. Make sure they don't know. But um, it'll be cool stuff. Um, number two, the end of year program. We are going to do the fanboys song with Stacy's class of boys. The girls are going to, logistically, we're going to practice this coming week. The girls, this Monday, the girls are going to come from one side of the um, sanctuary, the stage, and they're going to come up. They're going to have a sign with the fan, fan boys, fan boys, what you going to do, what you going to do, making one out of two. And then the boys are going to come on the other side with a sign, fan boys, fan boys, what you going to do, uh, connecting those words and those sentences to... And then everybody's going to sing it the third time. Fanboys, fanboys, what you going to do? What you going to do? Making one out of two. Fanboys, fanboys, what you going to do? Connecting those words and those sentences too. And then they're going to sing for and nor, for and nor, but, or yet so. And someone's going to have a card that says that for and nor, but, or yet so. And we're going to do that entire song. I'm, the song is connected. The link to the song will be connected in the detail <coughs> of this video it is on my page all you have to do is google fanboys if you're interested if you don't want to click the link um the wardrobe will be their cc shirts or their blue shirts dark blue or the teal they're gonna have dark glasses and a fedora or some kind of cool hat if they want to wear a cool leather jacket or something real cool some chains you name it that's fine but um and this is for all the kids and um, pair jeans with that. Nothing special in the bottom. But definitely the top has to be cool. You know what I mean? So um, uh, it's up to you. Whichever shirt you want them to wear. The, the teal or the navy. It all works. Make sure they have the other two. That'll be great. And I think Dollar Tree has those cheap fedoras available right now. They may be um, wicker. <laughs> not wicker. Basket or straw. But it'll work. The other thing, now this is the third and final thing that this video is going to entail. Uh, Faces of History papers. I'd like to have an electronic copy of your daughter's papers by tomorrow, end of business day. Those papers, <laughs> see, can't be seen. Avery just got out of one class and is going to another dance class. Go. See you in a minute, girl. Yes, ma'am. So, um... Faces of History, the research papers. If I could get a digital copy of your child's paper tomorrow, that would be so good. Uh, and it is for something specific that we're doing. Um, if, if this is too short of notice and you can't get it to me by the day after t until the day after tomorrow, well, that's okay, but ideally I'd love to get it tomorrow. And since most of them are typed, just send it to me in an email. Here's my email that I want you to send it to. Felicia Red CC at gmail.com. Please make sure you put the E in my name after the L, and that is a C I A dot R E D D C C. It is not case sensitive, so you don't have to have capital letters, but if you want to, it'll work. And make sure it's at gmail.com. That way, I will get it timely, and um, I'll send you a reply confirming that I received it. And uh, I can move forward and, you know, some more joyous things for the end of the year. <laughs> okay, so those are the three things. Um, we did a lot of review today, uh, Monday. Oh, my gosh. And then we, we went, we did um, verbals. We worked on verbals. The first two, I think we worked on infinitives and gerunds. 
No, we worked on infinitives and I don't have my stuff with me. That's why I'm having trouble. We worked on week 22 and 23 last week and this 24th week, because the 24th week is all review, we're going to work on week 23's verbals uh, for the 24th week. And then we're going to have a fun time. I think it'll be fun. It won't be a party. Unless you want to bring some goodies to share, go ahead. I encourage you all to bring stuff to share with everyone because after we do verbals, we're going to be done for the day. Um, we are going to do um, essentials. That's going to be quick. We are going to do math, and then we're going to do verbals, and then we're going to just have our uh, open up shop. And I think that's going to be about 15 to 20 minutes, maybe 30, if I can get the rest of the stuff done much quicker. So, um, you guys, it's going to be a fun time. And if you're not there on the 24th week, I'll be sure to purchase for you. So you won't, you'll miss the fun, but you won't miss the benefit. So um, don't be concerned. If you're get, your, your princess is not there, let her hear this. I'm going to be shopping for you, girl. If you're not there, you know who you are. <laughs> All right. Um, I think that's it. You guys have a wonderful week. Enjoy uh, working with your kids this week. I will see you on Monday. We are almost done. All right, be blessed, and until then, until we see one another on Monday, shalom, shalom, bye.